we? Um, it is such a wonderful day over here today. I'm in a really good mood. I get to show you all some really fun things. And um, if you're, uh, this video is about how I sanitize my store and my home space. So this is how I do it. Um, I have searched around through um, online on the internet, trying to find really good products that work well. Um, been As you know, through online ordering, it's a little tricky. So. Oh, hold on, let's turn this down. Okay, so so today, that's what this is going to be about. And again, this is my personal experience only, and I just want to share um, how it has worked for me. All right, if you are new to me and my channel, I am Terry Edmonds. I own a shoe store on Maui, Hawaii. I've had it for over 20 years. I am a shoe cobbler and yada, yada. I do a lot of shoe entrepreneurial things. <laughs> Um, but I also uh, shop online a lot nowadays, and so I've noticed that it's been kind of tricky to find stuff and know how they work. So uh, my store is um, awesome, and I will just start with uh, how to reach me. If you're trying to find any of these supplies, I do have an Amazon shopping cart, and I'm going to show you how easy it is to uh, get there. And... Um, First, uh, oh yeah, also for YouTubers, uh, thank you for joining me. I have people from Australia, New Zealand that watch, from New England, I mean from England. So I just want to say hi to everybody. I don't know what time it is there, but it's nine o'clock here in Maui, Hawaii. So thanks for joining me. Be sure to make a comment in the chat section. Let me know from where you're watching. That's always exciting for me. And with any questions that you might have through this process. I also have a website called terryedmonds.com. It's super easy and it looks a bit like this. And if you go just to terryedmonds.com, right on the front page, you can either click the Amazon button here. There's also another connection up here at the top. It's really easy. It's Amazon DIY supplies. So we're gonna do that because I'm gonna actually tell you some of the things about this product. This is my Amazon shopping cart. It's really cool. I make a percentage of everything that you guys buy and basically it supports my YouTube channel, which is where I get to be super creative and have fun. So if you do shop online there, thank you in advance. So I'm going to scroll on down here to my um, sanitizing products for the home or office. It's super easy. And it takes me to this great page. So we're gonna cover all of these today in just a moment, but I also wanna share with you YouTubers and some of you that have been subscribing and follow me that lovely this year I was selected by um, YouTube to be a part, to represent the state of Hawaii in the United States of YouTube. So you can actually go to their page and then click on Hawaii and here they have a, a gal from Oahu who's really cool. And then this guy, Jake Shimabukuru. Oh man, he is the most talented ukulele player. And then there's little old Terry Edmonds. So I'm super honored to be a representative for YouTube. It's so cool. YouTube gives us so many opportunities like this to be together. All right, so here we go. Let's get started. Uh, because I'm telling you this about my business doesn't mean it can't be applied in your home. I think it's the exact same stuff, same purpose, all of that kind of good stuff. So when I have a customer come in through the door, of course, I um, right in front of the door, I put this uh, little <laughs> very fancy hand sanitizer. Please sanitize your hands. And, um, you know, I'm actually going to move this just a little closer for us. Just a little bit. There we go. We can be. You guys can see the product a little better. How's that? Well, uh, it is what it is. Okay. So anyway, um, I did something like this. I had a little Purell bottle. Um, I love the hand sanitizer I carry. It is the best. So um, I originally bought this. And this is, I'm going to tell you, I'm walking through my um, Amazon shopping cart with you. So it's a Hana, Hanamichi automatic soap dispenser. Um, it's infrared motion sensor, waterproof base, adjustable switches. You can switch on the top and um, suitable for bathroom, kitchen, hotel, or office. I really like this because it is um, touchless. 
And it would have been great if I were using something like a Purell, but I didn't. I ended up ordering, because I needed a lot, because it's for a business, so I got this. This Z-Top, I think I have it um, in here. Let's just go back a second here. Yeah, I put this in the uh, file in the shopping cart for you guys. Um, this stuff is really great. It is a liquid sanitizer. It's an alcohol antiseptic. It applies, it conforms to the World Health Organization, the FDA, and some other guidance for COVID. I think it's just nice to have in general because it's super alcohol. But with that, it's really liquid. I mean, super liquid. So when I put it in my automatic soap dispenser and the uh, infrared senses it, it just goes all over the place. <laughs> so I ultimately ended up putting a jar underneath it. I mean, a jar, hello, a bowl <laughs> uh, underneath it and just go ahead. So when the client comes in, they just, I mean, it's so liquidy goes all over so you have to rub it all over <laughs> there's no getting around that one so I really like it because I know that um, my product I sell some very expensive shoes and things here so I know that um, people are got some nice sanitized hands when they're touching my product which is really great so I still love this. Um, I use this in uh, my wash basin area. So I did end up filling it with a sanitizing hand soap. Um, and I really love it. I have it turned off right now because it is very sensitive to motion. Um, but like I said, you can actually adjust. It has a really easy refillable top. You know, it's that easy. And um, when you press the button, which I won't do right now, um, you get, it's like three different uh, levels of soap that comes out so you can kind of determine for yourself I uh, really like it though and what I really like about it it is battery operated but it um, the batteries last a long time it took four let me see I think it's four triple A's and then it's got this nice little stand there we go it's got this little stand you can either use it with the stand or without and um, let's just also check out some other details about it, which I really like. Um, I think it's great that nobody has to touch it. That's a really cool thing and you know, it's great. So there we go. Um, I, so like I said, I ended up putting mine inside of a, a Purell jar. And I just want to come back here real quickly. Um, let's see if I've got anybody. We've got hello from uh, Long Island, awesome. Looking for a quality foaming touchless hand soap dispenser. Hey, that's awesome, Long Island. I'm telling you, I really like this. And I actually had put a little thicker um, soap inside it and it did not clog on me. Um, so, oh man, I'm so glad you mentioned it. That makes me feel really good. So that's really cool. Hi, Kathby. Hey, Merry Christmas, Mark. Love the hair in a ponytail, thanks. <laughs> Um, awesome. It's so great to chat with you guys. I love it. Thank you. And Mark, I got your shout out on the last video. So thank you. It means a lot. Okay. So moving on. So my clients, they'll walk in the front door. I definitely have everybody use hand sanitizer. So that's great. And then I also, um, ended up putting up, I separated my store and I ended up putting up a shower curtain and I got a really nice one. Let me go ahead and do this here. Um, I got this shower curtain and it is in the list. I looked for a lot of them because I still wanted it to look nice, you know, as much as a shower curtain can look. And so I have a drop ceiling and I am going to give you guys a look in a second here, but I did a, on um, my drop ceiling, I got these, uh, those drop ceiling hooks. They're also on my Amazon shopping cart. And then I just suspended the um, shower curtain from all the way to the top of the ceiling down and it comes past the counter. And, um, and then I just, for the very top of the shower curtain, I put this marabou feathers on it just to, you know, to glam it up as much as you can glam up a shower curtain and a shoe store. So I'm gonna just turn this around and show you guys here. Let's uh, see, here we go. 
All right, so here's the shower curtain we're all looking at together. And here is the marabou at the very top there. And then I went ahead and made sure that I overlapped these here. And here we're looking at the front of the store. Isn't that kind of fun? And I really like it. I'm going to turn this around again here. Here we go. Um, I actually, it's so funny because putting that shower curtain up there ended up being a huge perk. I wish I would have done it a long time ago because when I do shoe repairs, you can see in the back here behind me, all of these, this big equipment and stuff. Uh, shoe repair can be very smelly. It can put a lot of dust in the air. And I've always had my shoe store, shoe repair combination. And so now, like my electricity bill went down. I have three ACs in here, but it doesn't make them work so much trying to fill this big, I think it's 1500 square feet. So these shower curtains have actually been a super big blessing. I love it. And these are so nice. They have big glass weights in the bottom of them that allow them to hang really firm or uh, hang weighted. I really like that about them. And I did pick a really high quality shower curtain. And it's, uh, okay, so let's keep going. The other thing, so what I like about that is I can tell the difference from this room to the other room as far as uh, smell, as far as the temperature. Um, it, they can be two totally separate areas. So I think I've done a pretty good job of sealing off my own space in here. So this is like a really fun space. I love it. And I get to do all my work. Everything's great. I can talk with customers and um, there we have that. So moving on from there, let's say the customer uh, has tried on some shoes and I always ask them to leave their items on the in the showroom and I come over there and I sanitize them. So I went through a lot of different ultraviolet hand sanitizers. I'm going to go back to this one. I picked one out for you. Um, this It's the foldable ultraviolet light sanitizer wand, portable UV sterilizer lamp, perfect for travel, easy to use, the disinfector at home, office, car, hotel room, highly efficient against germ, bacteria, and viruses. That's the product description of it. And um, so I tried a couple of these because at the time I was also taking money from the, or exchanging credit cards for the clients and I wanted to zap it first. Um, and I have a solution for that now, a different solution, but I really like this a lot. Um, it's, it is rechargeable. So of all the things that I'm showing you, ultimately I went for rechargeable, except for the hand sanitizer Long Island. This one um, is battery operated, but it lasted a, the batteries last a really long time. You know, if you've experienced something different, write back and let me know. And I can, you know, let other people know. So anyway, it's just a USB charger and it just has one switch here and it will turn it on. You'll see here a little blue light. Yep, it's a very subtle blue light. I don't know if you can see it. They recommend not looking at it, so I don't look at it. Just turn it, you can just run it across the item. It's really great. So I used to do that with the credit card, just run you know, this across their credit card. And it's foldable, it's compact, really nice quality. I, I like it. I, I feel like it's something substantial and um, I think you could tuck it in your purse if you're traveling or something like that. Uh, this one's from JJ Care, but the one I put on there, I looked at it. I mean, I think there are a lot of companies just putting their name on the same product. So anyway, same price that I paid. So I like this. This is the JJ Care. I think this would be really great for your car too. You know, um, I had somebody from the police department who was like, oh, that'd be great because I'm using sanitizing wipes all the time. It'd be nice to have something else. You can get a battery, a car charger and you hook this up to a USB car charger. So cool, I really like this one. Okay, um, also, so I am a shoe repairer. And again, I didn't think of this up until now anyway. So I wish, I'm really glad that some of these things are coming to surface because they help my business. So I've got somebody with a shoe repair, let's say they bring in their boots and I now do no, I have got a uh, contactless 
a Visa processor now. And this thing is great. I put this on, you know, it's on the other side of that uh, curtain. And now the client can just insert their card right in the top. They don't have to even touch it. All they do is touch, it gets mounted on it. I have a little mount for it. It just sits right on the counter and they can slip their card right in the top. They can tap it. This is one of the, you know, fancy technology. <laughs> So they can tap, swipe, if whatever, they, there are a lot of different options, but I don't have to touch their credit card anymore. And that's really nice. So um, that takes away the need for my, ultra, my UV sanitizer. So let's say somebody has dropped off their boots now, they've paid because they pay in advance. And now um, what I'll do is I'll take their boots or shoes and I put them, I have a big Tupperware box, a, a real big one you know, maybe this big with the lid. And I got this thing, which is so cool. Let's go back. I'm going to read it to you because I think it is so sassy. I put it on here. This is great. Uh, my friend told me about this um, and I really like it. This is a UVC light lamp. It has the plug. It has, uh, it's a six watt ozone lamp. And um, let's see, I'm going to find out some details about it. It's particularly suitable for installation in closets, shoe cabinets, toilet, cupboard, etc. cetera. Um, it has a 110 volt, six watt uh, powerful lamp. Um, after you turn off this lamp, you must wait some time or, or keep the area ventilated until there is no smell. Then you can enter the room and approach the lamp. So this one has a lot of warning labels, caution labels, it is, uh, so let me keep going and then we'll cover some of those cautions about it. So I love it because it has this uh, timer right here. So I take this, I set it inside the Tupperware box, put the lid on it, and this is when I leave for the day. And then I go ahead and hit the timer for let's say 15 minutes. If a shoe came in and is pretty damp, you know, um, it's been rainy or something, I'll put it on longer. If it smells, I'll put it on longer. Um, if I just feel like it needs a little more, I'll do this. And I let it sit, even though it's only 15 minutes, it's something like you have to wait 12 hours before you can go back into this box again. So I'm really careful about that. Follow the instructions is what I tell myself all the time, <laughs> especially with this. So as they're saying, you got to wait before you can go back in the room or what have you. But anyway, I love mine. Um, and I only use it in the box. Uh, it includes a five foot cord and um, some accessories where it can be affixed. Um, it has a one year warranty on it. Uh, they say they're, uh, they're, it has an 8,000 hour lifespan, which is really nice. And they also have this 90 days to receive a full refund. I mean, gosh, the prices are so ridiculously affordable. Of course, prices change all the time, but I really like this. So um, that's a great thing. All right, so that's the end of the day. Uh, the other thing is because I am on, I try to, min I have so many customers that come in every day, it's awesome. Um, but I also like to kind of keep my distance a little bit so um, I can, I'm usually back here in my studio working and I've got this uh, shower curtain now. <clears throat> so in order to be able to assist more, I actually got this awesome Arlo camera set up. And this is great because you can actually talk to people. So if I needed to, I could talk to somebody in the front showroom and whatever if i needed to i do pretty well with i wear a mask and i stay my distance at least 10 feet just stuff like that um but i love this and it connects right through to my iphone it gives me notices when people walk in the store i love this so if you're looking for some kind of a system like this check out the arlo i really like the arlo i don't have any links to it for you i just wanted to share it because i really like it it's rechargeable, no batteries. Uh, this just gets installed on the wall. It has a magnet here and it just sticks. It hangs right on the wall in any position. Um, it stores video. I think it stores video up to like 28 days without a subscription. 
Um, I can go back and I mean, it's really great. So I love the Arlo. I think it's really affordable. I have had some other people ask me questions about security systems. So I really like this. It's super great. It's like having another person in the store with me. So that's great. And okay, so let's keep going. Let's go back to our products. Um, I love this air filter. I can't wait to share this with you guys. This thing is great. All right. I got two of these actually because I like them so much. So basically, um, you all saw the shot down my store. I have a run long store. All of the air conditioners are on one wall and they blow all the air this way. So I set these strategically along the wall, uh, on the floor, along the base of the wall, opposite of the AC. And these plug in, which is really awesome. And let's just, I'm gonna read some details about it because this guy is so cool. All right, so this is the Silveronics Air Purifier for Home with True HEPA filter, air quality monitor, a UV sanitizer, cleaner for allergies, pets, smokers, mold, pollen, dust. It's an, an odor eliminator and it covers about 500 square feet. I have about a thousand square feet up front, so I have two of them. And boy, um, you know what? Uh, I can't, I didn't bring an extension cord to plug it on to show you, uh, shame on me. But it has basically, I hit the power button, <clears throat> excuse me, hit the power button. And then I usually hit the ultraviolet and the Vitalon button. And then I hit the airflow pretty high, especially if it's uh, during a work day. And then I set the timer and I set the timer for the end of the day. So I don't even have to think about it when I leave, they all shut off. Um, they're easy to, it's very easy to replace the filters in these. They are really, they're so quiet that unless I put it on the highest speed of number five on airflow, I can't even hear it. But it also has this um, great, what did they call it? It was a air quality monitor. And I remember I had this at the house first. I was trying it at the house and we had, we were cooking something that created some smoke and this thing totally caught it right away. It was a very low smell of smoke, but you could see the light indicator change that the air quality had changed. Um, but again, it was still kind of quiet. You can adjust the lighting on it. It has some cool LED lighting. Um, I don't use it because I don't need to in the store. Um, but anyway, I love that thing. It's so great of all of the items on the list. I think this one's my favorite. And I really do like, well, oh yeah. Gosh, I'm so glad I looked at my shopping list because I have another awesome item. All right, so this one runs all day. We've got them sanitizing their hands during this, during this shopping visit. They're using their contactless credit card. We're uh, taking care of any problems with, their, with this awesome little light. Um, and then of course, I personally, uh, I always use this Lysol, so this is really great. When I do it for, when I clean, I clean using uh, my uh, gloves. Because what's the point in, you know, I don't wanna touch it. So I'm clean with the gloves, that's awesome. If somebody happens to come into my store and they, you know, like they're right now, you know, let's say somebody wants an extra mask, I try to keep some on hand for them. And then we have the end of the night. So with the end of the night, I do their ozone treatment in the box for the shoes. And I do this light, which is so great. I got this funky little light base from my neighbor Goodwill as a couple bucks. And I just uh, screwed in this light and we'll talk about that light right now. Um, let's see here. So, um, this is an LED UV light sanitizer, 25 watt UVC disinfection lamp, LED corn light, germicidal lamp, sterilizer light, ultraviolet ozone sterilization for home, kills 99% of germs and viruses. So um, it says energy saving. Um, actually, since I've installed all these things, I've had uh, no increase to my electric bill. So that's been really great. And I run, like I said, those two air filters all day on high. Um, 
So this is a 360 degree beam angle with aviation aluminum, aluminum heat sink, fast cooling, durable, isolated driver filled with glue, longer life, safe and efficient, ultraviolet light combined with ozone. The germicidal lamp can sterilize 360 degrees in all directions. It's professional and reliable. Uh, it's a high quality quartz lamp tube can maintain high, high efficiency effect. Um, anyway, I really like it. So I just plug it in and it comes with a timer because you don't want to be in the room when you do this. And I believe this also has a, um, do not expose your eyes and skin to the light during work while it's working. Uh, make sure that it's off before you approach it. Just read the instructions, you guys, you know? Um, so anyway, I plug it in. I have my remote that goes with this right by the front door and it has a little holder. So I take my remote, I zap it, depends on how many people I've had in for the day. Um, so set it and leave. It is so easy, the timer goes off and there I am in the morning and you can really tell the difference. It is so funny, the air actually smells fresher. So that's a really cool, again, inexpensive. Let's check this out. I mean, the one I'm looking at here, I don't see a price on it, but you know, I'm a budget gal. So anything I buy has got to be in a budget that I can handle. So there we go. Now I want to, we're going to come back here and I want to see what we've got that we can all chat about here. I'm going to see, I lost my page. Sorry guys. All right. Chat's disabled now. Oh my gosh. I'm so sorry. I'm not a tech person. I'm a shoe person. So, um, this is, I know it's kind of a short video today, but I think we pretty much covered it. Um, uh, again, how to reach me is on my YouTube channel where you can subscribe, you can hit the notification bell, which tells you when I do new videos. You can also find me at terryedmonds.com. Go to my Amazon shopping cart to find all the supplies there by category. So easy to find. Um, you can always send me an email through terryedmonds.com. I get a lot of people that reach out to me. Um, I wish I had my YouTube working so I could chat right now, darn it. Uh, I'm going to get that fixed at some point. <laughs> I will get better, but um, I'll look at it in a minute when I'm done. Thank you so much for following. I love you guys. Uh, hi, mom. That's another one. And tomorrow, if you guys are interested, I'm doing my Amazon live on Fridays. And tomorrow we're going to review all of my high tech camera gear that I have uh, found that I use for my YouTube studio. And so that's going to be a really fun review. And again, it's amazon.com forward slash shop, forward slash Terry Edmonds. And with that, I'm out of here. Okay, love you. Aloha from Maui.